Hey everyone, my name is Matt. Welcome to my backyard. I just finished up a three-part series on my log hauling trailer. If you haven't checked those out already, feel free to check those out. But in part three, I picked up a large ash log and just yesterday I went out and I picked up this even bigger ash log. <laughs> this one here is uh, 10 foot, eight inches long. It's uh, 32 inches at the butt, 36 inches about halfway up the trunk. And up here, it's about 42 inches wide. This thing has an estimated weight of around three and a half thousand pounds, which is more than a thousand pounds more than the previous largest log that I picked up with this lift. So let me show you how the whole pickup process went. Yeah, it's from. Nice man. Hi, baby. Let's see what happens, huh? What? Let's see what happens. Oh. That was really easy. Huh? That was really easy. So now this thing is back here in my yard. I have to get this thing off my trailer. So let's get this thing unchained and get it off of here. So first I need to get this trailer in line with this tree and I gotta move this log that I kind of ran over. <laughs> Now since this log is sitting in front of my winch, I need to pull it back off the trail a little bit so I can roll the log and then get access to the winch. And I'll just scoot this log over so it's out of the way of the winch cable. And I'll place my jack stands under the back of the trailer 
so that the weight of the log is supported as it's being pulled off the trailer. So there we go, off the trailer and right where I wanted it, for the most part, within a few inches. <laughs> Unloading it with the arch instead of hooking it directly to the snatch block and just winching it off the trailer just makes it a little more controlled and it puts less stress on my truck and my trailer because the arch will actually pick up the log and remove some of that friction to help it slide off the trailer a little bit easier than just trying to yank it off. And uh, so yeah. <laughs> That's about it. So next I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go around and clean up all the cuts on this log. They've been sitting out for a while. They're pretty checked. They're uh, grayed from the sun. So I'm gonna cut those back and seal up those new cuts so this log can sit here for a little bit longer without having any problems with additional checking. So that's about it for this one. <laughs> Thank you as always for watching. I greatly appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this little adventure. <laughs> if you have any questions, or comments about anything in this video or anything in my other videos, please feel free to leave me a comment. As always, I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. And until next time, happy woodworking.